Hi H3 vloggers, it's Amber, your yoga guru, and today for Fitness Friday, it's the Friday after Christmas or the holiday season, so I'm going to invite you to do some cleansing twists. Twists are really cleansing, uh, they also help to really invigorate circulation in your body. So the first thing we're going to do is if, you're not, if you don't have a yoga mat, go ahead and roll out a yoga mat or a towel on the ground, and then step to the top of your mat. You'll inhale, reach your arms up, maybe look up, and then exhale, you're going to sit back, Utkatasana. So here your legs are squeezed together, your big toe mounds are touching, your weight's back in your heels. Breathe in here, and then exhale, bring your hands to your heart center. You'll take your left elbow, spin it to the outside of that right knee, coming into prayer twist. You'll press into your palms, so your palms are going to come essentially to the center, right at your sternum, center of your heart, as you twist through your thoracic spine. Breathe here, hold this twist for about five to eight breaths. When you're finished, hold through the last exhalation, and then go ahead and fold forward. Inhale, reach your arms up, and then exhale, sit back in, Utkatasana, awkward chair. This time bring your hands to your heart center. On the exhale, you'll take your right elbow, spin it to the outside of that left knee, coming into prayer twist on the opposite side. Again, holding five to eight breaths. On your last exhalation, you can fold forward. Inhale, rise up, reach your arms up, maybe look up, and then exhale, bring your hands to your heart center. The next twist we'll do is crescent lunge twist. So we'll step back, crescent lunge, stepping back with your left foot. Left foot comes back into a crescent lunge. You're in the heel of your right leg. As you reach back, your heel's off the ground on the left leg. So you're inviting your quadricep muscle on the back leg to work by reaching back through your heel. Reach your arms up here. Inhale. Exhale, bring your hands to your heart center. Take your left elbow this time, spin it to the outside of that right knee. Again, beginning to press your palms together as you really twist through that thoracic spine. With every exhalation, you want to invite just a little bit more twist, a little cleansing, inviting new oxygen, creating more circulation. Five to eight breaths here. And then you'll simply hold through the exhale, you can square your front foot, and then step to the top, switch sides. Right leg comes back here. Reach your arms up on the inhalation, coming into crescent lunge on the left side. Exhale, bring your hands to your heart center. Take your right elbow this time, spin it to the outside of that left knee, coming into prayer twist, or excuse me, not prayer twist, crescent lunge twist on the left side. Pressing your palms together. Begin to invite and provoke a little bit more twist to that thoracic spine. Breathe here, full breaths. Five to eight breaths. On the exhalation, hold through the final exhalation, and then square your front foot. Step into the top and take a seat. The final twist we'll do is a seated twist. You'll take your right leg, cross it over your left, making sure that your right hip is on the ground, grounded. You can take your left hand, grab a hold of your right knee, hug your right knee in, and then use your right arm as a surrogate spine to create more length in your spine. You'll begin to twist. If you're comfortable here and you can pin your left arm to the outside of that right knee, go ahead and do so. And then begin to twist. With every inhalation, grow a little bit taller through the crown of your head. And as you exhale, you begin to twist more through your thoracic spine. Breathing here. Five to eight breaths. And then you'll simply switch sides. So this time, crossing the left leg over your right. Again, adjusting yourself so your hip bone is down. You'll hug in that right knee or left knee with your right arm. Take your left hand behind you, create a surrogate spine. If you want, you can block and then begin to twist. Again, five to eight full inhalations and exhalations. And then you'll simply begin to bring it right back to center. And you can close your practice. So I thank you for practicing with me today and I hope that I have invited you and that you will really enjoy these twists. Namaste.